Yeah, so how did the exhibition come about? I was commissioned by Roxbring about 12 months ago to document life in Southside. Uh, they were building the forum, this amazing new apartment block, and wanted to get uh, a feel for life in Southside. So it was like a dream commission for me because it was just straightforward street photography, uh, documentary photography, just seeing what life was like there. I think I explored every single inch of Southside as well and it was great to, to get to know the area. I took thousands of images and as we came to the end of the commission and the forum itself was nearly completed, somebody suggested an exhibition and of course well, I was never going to say no to that myself. Um, and then when somebody said that they could host it at the Hippodrome, this like hugely iconic place in the city, this, this place that everybody knows, um, again, I, I was more than happy with that. The next big challenge that we had was whittling down these thousands of images into a handful to actually be exhibited. Um, and it was always going to be a difficult task, but we, we rounded up a, a group of judges and they were some of the most influential people in the city, so I was really nervous, to be honest about it, and really apprehensive. And the day that we actually chose the images was really good fun, but also a little bit heart-wrenching watching my images get torn apart. Um, but I'm really happy with the choices that they've made, even if a few of my favourite ones did kind of slip through the ranks. Um, but yeah, that was good fun. With the exhibition we really wanted to show what the area got to offer so we broke it down into four categories. Obviously the people are the most important thing about the area but the places are really special. The festival, so the nightlife and the activities that they have on there um, and also the street art and that, that really brings in the surrounding areas as well um, and it really is just a, a massively entertaining place. I feel like I've only really touched the tip of the iceberg of what Southside's got to offer and I think with developments like the Forum and Smithfield it's really going to open up this gateway for the rest of the city to start exploring just how good Southside is and the surrounding areas. I think it's only really just the start for Southside now um, and obviously Birmingham isn't a city that stands still so I'm sure it will go from strength to strength over the next few years. Yeah, what's next for me? Uh, I think I'm just going to keep exploring the streets and taking images. <laughs>